With our quiz created, we're ready now to deploy it to make it available for students. Go to a suitable section, assessments or otherwise, and choose under assessments test to add your test. You'll be able to select from all the tests you've created. In this case, we have one video test and hit submit. And then it will bring up various options for you. You can edit the description and you can show the description to students before they begin the test. So we can, we can click to do that. The test instructions include the embedded video and we want the students to be able to see the instructions before they begin the test so that they can watch the video and then start the test. But the instructions will be available throughout the quiz itself. We want to make the link available so it's available for students to take the quiz. Um, I generally, you can add an announcement, but it's probably easier to add your own announcement with a direct link to the quiz. When you add the quiz, it will automatically uh, appear under what's new for you. Allow students to take it multiple times, and if you're grading it, um, allow them to choose the highest grade so that they get the highest mark if they take it multiple times. You can specify the number of attempts as well, if, for example, you want to limit it to a certain number of attempts. But here we'll allow unlimited, unlimited attempts. Um, all the other settings are as per default, and we'll just leave them as they are. And if we scroll down further, we can choose whether students can see the correct answers. So after they've submitted, they can see the answer they've submitted and whether they've got it, the score per question. But if you want, you can also specify the correct answer and whether they also see the feedback. So if you've added feedback and you want students to be able to see that, you need to make sure you click here. The test presentation all at once or one at a time prohibited backtracking. In this case, we'll leave it all at once, meaning the students can watch the video, see all the questions and edit them all before hitting submit. Click on submit and this will deploy the quiz for your students. So if we click on the student preview button, which is just above what you can see on the screen, you can see that now when a student comes in, they can click on assessments and they have the test ready to run. So clicking on the test, you can see the student will see the description. They'll be able to watch the video here, press play and see the video. They can maximize it to watch it full screen and pause it and rewind it. It gives them details about how often they can do the quiz. And then when they click on begin, the video is still here, so you can still watch the video and they can see all the questions underneath, the multiple choice questions and the open-ended question. When they save and submit, then they'll see the marks and feedback as you have set up for them. That's it.